Hello, everybody. Welcome to a special series of Board Off. I'm Ken Levitsky. And I'm Chris Fedek. And today, we're going to be talking about one of these five games from Channelcraft, made in the USA. Really cool little home-style games. And, uh, yeah. You ready? Yeah, this is going to be good. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Let's do it. Welcome back for part two, part two of Board Off X Channelcraft. <laughs> Today, Flipping Birds game. I don't believe this one came from uh, 1763, like old pack shooters. Oh, yeah, I know, I know. However, we've played this, and it's awesome. <laughs> I love this. I think I probably just really love it because I was way better at it than you. <laughs> and you don't have a hat to give you extra power today. Oh, that's right. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. Now I regret not buying that, like, you know, those ch chicken hats that they make for. I, uh, I bet you do. Chicken hats? Yeah, I regret not buying that. <laughs> flipping Birds, the captivating bird flipping tabletop game. And if you're as confused by that as we were when we read it, don't worry. We're going to explain it. And it's, it's pretty simple. It's pretty easy. Channelcraft, made in the USA. Very cool little game for the family. Beautiful. Packaging, once again, great artwork. I don't know who they get for their artists, but great artwork. You get a wooden bowl, okay? And when we first opened that, I just was, I just thought that was the greatest thing ever. Right. Was that this wooden bowl was in there. We were looking at this. It says, flip your birds towards the pond, collecting points as they land. And there's a wooden bowl. And we're like, ha, can you imagine if you got a wooden bowl with this? Pop this open. First there's thing you see, bowl. wooden bowl. Like... And again, so well done. Completely handmade. Yeah. Love it. Yeah, it looks like someone turned it out on a lathe and then smoothed it out. It's very high quality. Very high quality. Okay, so we're gonna pop this right open and I'm gonna dump all our birds. So all oh, kinds of birds. birds. All them flipping birds. And Wait, it's my coffee. <laughs> oh. Drowning birds, the game. <laughs> Man, which kind would this just be? Like, oh, it's like a hawk. Mm. I was thinking if that was a duck, that would be like the perfect <laughs> thing to do, but it's, it's not. Um, <laughs> just like their last game, beautiful color, full color instructions. They fold right out. They tell you the instructions, how to play, different versions to play. Two to four players on this one. I mean, one person can sit there and just play by themselves if they really wanted to. Go. What did we do last time? I think we just did, yeah, just plain Jane duck pond? Bird? I think so. It was just the basic game. We basically didn't really follow a game. We kind of just shot away. Yeah. Flipping Birds is a highly captivating game of dexterity and skill. A simple flick of the finger will send each flipping bird flying. Flip your birds towards the pond. <laughs> that almost went in. That was amazing. That was so amazing. Um, collecting points as they land. <laughs> I'm just amazed by that. The player with the most points is the winner. Flip or flop. Flipping your birds is simple, but mastering the flip is challenging. Impossible, I would say. I don't think it's impossible. It's a mission. It's a mission impossible. If you choose to accept it. To start, place a bird in front of you with its head facing you. We've got multiple birds here, right? Yep. Where's it? Uh, where's it list the birds? There's uh, an eagle. We got the dead duck. Oh no, that, that's, that's the scoring. That's the scoring. Uh, some sort of yellow bird, maybe a cardinal. Yeah. Is that, where, 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 where's the ice? Oh, I think. Is that it? Uh, there they are. Oh, there we are. Right, all birds. Nope. Uh, it's just listing them. Nope. I think on the. I saw something over here. Oh, no, it's the same thing you had yeah. before. So, I mean, I don't know what kind of birds they are. There's a chickadee or something. There's an eagle. The eagle's pretty easy to notice. <laughs> I just realized. So, you have the front side of the bird. Yeah. And then the actual underside of the it's bird. It's the bottom it of the bird. The bottom. Yeah. So they, didn't yeah. Just, they didn't just copy like, the uh, top over over it. It's actually the bottom side of the bird underneath. So well done. I'm going to go up to this <laughs> camera. 
There's the bottom side, and then there's your top side. So well done. <laughs> yeah, it's just little touches like that that make, uh, that make it just that much better. <laughs> <laughs> so then, with your index finger, you press down on the head, you send it flying. Finding the right amount of pressure is the key to landing Lucky Ducks in the pond. I had this down right away. <laughs> Because I figured it's all in the fingernail. I still think he steamed it open and then played it for hours and hours before we did the unofficial. It's all in the fingernail. You got to fingernail the beak. Fingernail the beak. And then let him fly. <laughs> we're totally, <laughs> we're totally, yeah, I'm going to move my coffee for this. <laughs> That'd be a good idea. I'm going to just put it somewhere. Five bucks if you still yeah. get on the coffee after it. Because I... <laughs> I really feel like we're gonna get some birds in the coffee. One, make sure bird's head is facing you. Two, press down on tip of beak. Three, flip the bird toward the pond. It's as simple as that, and it is as fun as Chris is making it look. Yeah. And even the slightest difference in pressure just makes the bird go in a completely different distance <laughs> and direction. Like, <laughs> uh, uh, What else we got in here? We got gather the flock. Before you can begin setting up is dependent upon which flipping birds game is being played how many players are playing and the players ages you may decide that you need the pawn cup further away or closer to a younger player to help them along as the games progress adjust as ne <clears throat> as necessary in order for all players to have fun so that's great you're younger than me so i guess you can have the bond a little closer perfect all right now watch me miss anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even close. Special care. Although these birds are not pets, they might need some care after many, many flipping fights. If any bird loses its spring, give each leg a slight bend towards the bird's underside to return it to full light. It's just really bent the legs. <clears throat> and then they literally show you how to do it. How oh, to nice. bend the legs. I, it's amazing how much thought goes into these instructions. They list everything. Mm. But I say I like they don't assume anything's like obvious. Yeah. They just show it anyways, which yeah. is nice. And all full art too, like color and art. Yeah. So, yeah, and it's nice they show everything exact like that because yeah, you never know. Someone might read it wrong or yeah. misinterpret what you're saying. Yeah. So it's it's really a nice touch to add every detail like that. So here we have the scoreboard letting you know how to keep score. Dead duck is a duck that lands on its back. Zero points. Sitting duck on tail and legs, 10 points. Sick chick on its side, 20 points. Silly goose standing on its head, 30 points. Wild turkey hanging onto the cup rim, 40 points. Lucky duck, a swan dive into the cup, 50 points. Hey, wasn't there another one that's worth more? Oh, yeah, I thought one, I thought one of the other ones just said, wait, wasn't there another one that's higher than that? So, so <laughs> let's just not get it in the cup. It's worth more. I don't know. Uh, should we play one of the versions? Yeah, we could try one of the variations. Let's see. Okay. Let's play Just Lucky Duck. All right. Two players. One, two. Eight birds each. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Probably should match the types as well, so we know who's is who's. Okay, fine, <laughs> Chris, with the logic, I totally get that. Okay, so what's this bird? So you can have the yellows, and I guess I'll take these orange ones. I got most of those, and the brown guy. You get the eagles. Eagles? No, no, eagles soar. I need something that flies lower. <laughs> After ma mastering the lucky duck shot, you might want to step up your game. Oh, we haven't even done the mastering. <laughs> well, let's step game. it up. Okay. Oh, well, let's kick it up a notch then. Right? <laughs> In this game, only lucky ducks count for points. Okay, and lucky duck was a perfect swan <laughs> dive into the cup. All right. <laughs> All right. Easy peasy. Why not give us something harder? <laughs> All right, uh, 10 points, 10 bonus points are given for every lucky duck in succession. Therefore, if a player sinks four lucky ducks in a row, they get a 40 point bonus at the end of the round. Take turns flipping birds and tally the score at the end <clears> of each <throat> round. 
Play to 1,000 points? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's... Oh, okay, this is... Um, uh, I mean, I get it. You want the game to run long. In this situation, we can't really have the game run that long. So, let's just do Especially a couple rounds. Our skill let's just level. do a couple rounds and, and see who's winning. <laughs> Especially right. with our skill level. We can't play that long. <laughs> All right, ready? All right, here's our 24-hour marathon starting. I'll let you go first because you're young. All right. You're the youngster. All right, now watch this shot, old man. All right. I'm watching. I'm watching. Now, my birds are in formation, so this better work out. <laughs> oh, oh, that doesn't count for anything. Which one's that one called? Uh, I don't know, the hanging off the rim one. <laughs> Wild turkey hanging on cup rim. All right, here we go. Perfect swan dive into the pond. Oh, oh dead dog. <laughs> dead, dead dog. <laughs> All right. Oh, dead. Wah, 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 wah. And dead. Oh. Right. oh, man. I guess this is working out because eagles have really good vision, and this one's just, these ones are just laser pinpointing, but these other ones are just, nope, I'm going wherever. <laughs> They're all dying. <laughs> look, look at all the dead birds. Oh, well, I didn't die. Well, that one is sitting duck. That one would have been a sitting duck. Ah! There we go. Maybe we have to put water in the room to slow them down a little bit. <laughs> Played you a thousand points and you can't even get a point. <laughs> <laughs> right. Ah. We might just have to play to. Yeah! Dead duck. Still in the bowl. That's all that matters. <laughs> Doesn't count. This one's eating it, <laughs> but it still counts. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that one might have stayed in there if the other one wasn't in the way. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, well. All right, so uh, we got lots of wild turkeys. <laughs> you know what? Let's just play the regular game. Let's, let, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like the regular we didn't game. We sick chick stuff. Finding on its side. We really didn't get much of anything on that game. <laughs> I got a lot of dead ducks. I got a whole dead flock right here. The sick chick. Oh. I shouldn't have made all those extra berries and nuts. Oh! <laughs> Staring at the cup. I'm one with the cup right now. Here we go. Dead duck. Okay. Oh, you doubled it! <laughs> Double dead duck. Yeah, I like that. I like that. It's a full block. Oh! Oh, my bird is gone. Oh, I can reach it with my foot. Uh, okay, I'm back. All right, let's see if we can get a formation going. Three at once? Yeah. Flying in a V formation. Mighty ducks. Oh! <laughs> Unfortunately, the leader missed, and the other three, two, just followed it right into the side. <laughs> I don't know what it is. This room makes me play horribly. I did good on the last game. I did good on this game when we were practicing. And now I just get dead ducks. There's a bunch of dead birds all over the table. It's horrifying. Oh, I touched it. I, I touched the bowl that time. You it. <laughs> That's like the drinking bird. Oh, there we go. The sick chick. Sick chick. And a bunch of dead ones. Maybe you, uh, maybe you should tell your birds not to eat that seed anymore. <laughs> I think that suet went bad. Oh. oh. I'm getting the distance down on a lot of these, but I'm missing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the dead birds. So there we have um, a round of the Flippin' Bird game where we just did horrible. Wow. <laughs> that one is long so gone. So you stack them up, you can turn them into bullets. Jeez. <laughs> Let's just play until we can at least get a few in. <laughs> at least one. Oh, come on. It's got to be the tilt on the table. <laughs> Tilt on the table and the lights and <laughs> look at I went oh! in and out again and the pressure of people watching. Yeah. Oh. 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 I, feel, I feel like I'm getting closer. <laughs> oh. We've been trying for the consistency oh. trick and it's not working. In and out. It's like even the slightest difference in how far these are bent from each other completely <laughs> changes where they're... Oh. 
No, there's one still alive. Come on, man, you can do it. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay, you know what? I gotta fly with an eagle. I'm taking the eagle for flight. Here we go. Oh. You weren't trying to go to the moon. The eagle, the eagle has not landed. Gone. You tried to save it though. I appreciate <laughs> you trying to save that. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Yeah, that's it. Oh. Can't even just like hang the rim. Yes! <laughs> you seeing that? Is everybody seeing that? Okay, good. Eagle landed. Eagle Boom! landed. <laughs> All right, this is definitely not going to work, but we'll see. No, this is going to go awful, but I'm going to enjoy it. This is going to go horribly wrong. <laughs> oh, you almost knocked my eagle out. He's barely hanging in there. Hey! Nice. Here we go. Feeling it. Yeah! It's coming back to me. It's coming back. I'm feeling. I'm, I'm one with the pond. Oh, oh that's the trick. You gotta do one of those kung fu close your eyes tricks, alright? <laughs> yeah, I can try with my eyes closed. Nope. <laughs> okay, left handed. Nope. Okay, with my nose. My <laughs> eye! It's definitely taking your eye out. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. The ring. You, you said that and now I'm worried about my eye. Oh, the ring. Oh. That actually worked. Let me try the power ring instead. <laughs> My, my bird doesn't want to... Like, I'm not proposing to you, bird. Get out of here. The rune ring. Oh, the rune ring. Feel the power of the Norse gods. Actually, that might destroy and vaporize it. <laughs> <laughs> the bird just dies. <laughs> oh, the aim was off, but it's distant, right? I mean, this is one of those games where, yeah, there's rules. You should follow them. You should play the, the many variations of the game. But it's just fun to flip the birds. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's the whole point of games like this, is I to mean, have fun. I'm not so. keeping score, but I know I have more birds in the bowl than you. <laughs> Says the guy who claimed he wasn't keeping score. I'm not keeping score. I don't know what score that is. I just know I'm winning. I'm not keeping score, but I'm totally destroying you. <laughs> oh, almost. Oh... Uh. That's it. Bird, take off. Quack, 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 quack. That did not go anywhere near as far as the lower ones that I pressed. For. Fly south. Place a game in front. Of, place a cup in front of each player. Place a cup. Oh, you got to bring your own cups. Okay, it makes sense. <laughs> no. What's B I R D? This game is similar to the popular game using a basketball called horse. Decide who goes first. Make up and announce any flipping bird shot. And if the shot is successful, your opponent has to replicate it. Oh. If this shot is not replicated, the letter B is given. And so on until the word bird is spelled. Okay, that's a cool game. Birds gone wild. <laughs> Each player will have four birds of one species no. and one different bird. <laughs> This game is played and under the same rules and set up as Flipping Birds classic game with one twist. The bird that is different from your other birds is your wild bird. This bird can be flipped during any of your turns, though most sacred for last. When the bird is scored, it gets double points. Oh, okay. All right. Flipping Birds game. Chris, <laughs> review this bad boy. Uh, well, I. I like the uh, the bright, happy, exciting colors on the package. I feel, the, I feel uh, happy in the box. Yeah, it gets really bright and vibrant, and yeah, uh, really attention grabbing. Yeah, uh, there's a flamingo here, even though it's not in the game, which is just awesome. Uh, the game itself, <laughs> which is awesome. I really want to play as a flamingo. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, the game itself, though, I, I really enjoy it. I mean, it's um, very simple. Mm -hmm. uh, very good quality parts. I thought these were... Uh, uh, cardboard. Cardboard. Right? First, I thought they were going to be cardboard. Some sort of laminated plasticky thing, like a compressed plastic. Yeah. So these will last a very long time, even if you abuse them. Like, I can shove this right down, and it's still bent and it's exactly the same. It didn't squash it flat. Yeah. So it's really well done. Uh, the game's really fun. Uh, you don't have to follow the rules if you don't want to, really. Uh, which is nice. You can just flip them and yeah, just, just have fun. free form play. And like I said, it's two to four players, but you could just play this by yourself. You yeah. could just sit there one day and go, eh, let's flip some birds towards the pond. Yeah. Yeah, and each of the games themselves, I'll if, probably you want to, uh, if you want to play uh, the actual variant games, they're mm -hmm. all very simple, easy to find. I mean, everybody has cups. Yep. Or something you can use as a cup. Yep. Uh, so you can play the two-player one. Or the, at least this two-player one. There's a few other ones. Mm -hmm. um, the bird game, like horse, uh, or your imagination. So yeah, make your own game up even. Like, yeah. it's, it's very easy to free form it like that. It's really well designed. Super well designed. Great artwork, colorful, beautiful instructions. Again, awesome little guys. They could also like they could sell different types of birds like this. People would buy it. Yeah. Oh, I'll buy an add-on pack for flipping birds. Well, like pogs almost. Yeah. Those things were massive back then. Exactly. Yeah. Back in the old days, the pogs, they the were massively exciting and popular. I want to buy the, the flamingo expansion pack. <laughs> and a penguin. Makes no sense. Well, it'd be awesome if He's they got a beak. That. He's got a beak. I would dig it. Yeah, or sell even a variant so you have like a different bowl and that and you can mix yeah. them together if you want to. Yeah. Yeah. Like, and again, like many possibilities. the woodworking on this is phenomenal. Like, honestly, when I opened this downstairs, I thought my wife was going to steal this bowl from us. <laughs> she likes little little strange bowls and cups and stuff. Yeah. So she saw them and she's like, oh! And you're like, I was like, no! <laughs> it belongs to flipping birds. You can't take the pond. That said, it'll be gone after we finish this episode. You'll find it on a shelf, like holding little knickknacks in it or yeah. something. What is that? What is that? What am I going to flip my birds into now? I'll get your coffee mug. <laughs> Fine. Once again, Channelcraft has another winner. Yeah. Two nice. thumbs up. Definitely buy this one for the holidays. Kids would have so much fun just sitting around a Christmas tree or wherever playing this, flipping their birds. Yeah. I yeah, mean, this is the perfect stocking stuffer travel game. You're in a hotel awesome room, just game. toss it on the table. Uh, yeah. You could probably do it in the car, but that's usually going to, the driver's going to take one in the eye, so don't use this in the car. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> What's going on back there? <laughs> 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 don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> it's crash. <laughs> Flip. Yeah. Go check it out. Channel Craft, we'll have a link down below. As usual. Chris, this was, uh, this was another fun one. Yeah. I enjoyed it greatly. I can't wait to do our third Channel Craft game next week. Right here. Same spot. Same time. Same location. Same hair and clothes. Of course. Why not? I can't believe we have to wait a whole week, though, before we film it. Yeah. Or a whole week until we just shower again. Yeah. Yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah, we can't change our look at all. So we're no. not going to bathe or anything for the whole week no. until we get back. It was in the contract. You can find us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. You can find our other shows over on Apple Podcasts and SoundCloud. This right here, Board Off, is exclusive to YouTube. So you can see our beautiful faces and the awesome games that we play, such as Flipping Words from Channel Craft. That, that was great. I'm going to try. I want to get this one's coming for that camera. Now we have to film in 3D. Yeah. Everybody's going, whoa, whoa, flipping birds.